All right. Let's go over one of the division problems from the homework. Come on, focus. Come on. There we go. All right, number seven. We have x cubed plus x squared plus x plus 2 divided by x squared minus 1. Now, we're going to write this out, but when you write it out, notice that I'm adding this extra term here. This x cubed plus x squared plus x plus 2, this is being divided here. It's being divided by this polynomial here. And I'm adding that 0x to the middle. If I add 0 times x, it doesn't matter what x is. I'm really just adding 0 to this, so I'm not changing the value. I'm allowed to do that. So I, I took my x squared minus 1, and I just threw a 0x in the middle for a placeholder. Um, that should help us get to our next. So what multiplies times x squared to get it down to uh, x cubed? Well, x. So x times x squared is going to be x cubed. x times 0x is going to be uh, 0x squared. x times minus 1 is going to be minus x. And let's subtract. x cubed minus x cubed, 0. x squared minus 0, x squared. All right x minus negative x, x minus negative x. Well, that's the same thing as saying x plus x. So that's x squared plus 2x. And then we're going to have this, uh, this plus 2 carry down here. All right. x squared plus 0x minus 1 times what is going to get me something down here? x squared times 1. That x squared times 1 is going to get me x squared right there. Times 1 is going to get me 0x times 1 is going to be 0, so plus 0x. And 1 times negative 1 is going to be negative 1. All right. Once again, let's subtract. Those cancel out. This is going to remain 2x. And this is going to be uh 2 minus negative 1 or 2x plus 3 but we we we've reached the end of the line so this ends up being our remainder this is our remainder so this divided by this or let, let me let me let me write it like this x cubed plus x squared plus x plus 2 divided by x squared minus 1 is going to equal x plus 1 plus the remainder over what you were dividing by x squared minus 1. So that right there would be our final answer. Hopefully that clarified some things. Um, hopefully it's just another of the many of examples that you've watched to figure this out. Um, let me know if you have any questions on this stuff, but hopefully this question cleared up some questions on polynomial division. Okay, cheers. Bye.